Hi there, welcome to Tech Abbey. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about BIOS. Before I get started, I request you to subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon so that you won't miss any of our future videos. Back in those days when I have a Windows laptop, whenever I need to install a fresh OS in my laptop, I used to tweak around this BIOS settings. That's what I know about BIOS at that time. But what is this BIOS? BIOS stands for Basic Input Output System. It's a small chip on your motherboard in read-only memory. It is the first component which starts up when you power on your computer. BIOS simply wakes up all other components on your motherboard. It instantly checks the other components on your motherboard. If everything is ok, it hand over the control to the main software, which is Windows. If you hear a single beep when you power on your computer, then everything is ok with your hardware. If you hear multiple beeps, it means something wrong in your hardware. There might be a problem with your RAM, processor or any other chipset components on your motherboard. BIOS simply acts as a bridge between your software and hardware. That's why we also call it as a motherboard firmware. Since it is the first component that starts up when you hit the power button, we also call it as a boot up device. There is a limitation with BIOS. It can't handle storages more than 2 TB. To handle this problem, we have introduced UEFI. Unified Extensible Firmware Interface. It can handle up to millions of terabytes of storage. Mostly we find BIOS on Windows machines because Mac uses EFI, Extensible Firmware Interface. You can control your hardware by tweaking some of the BIOS settings. You can set your CPU clock rate, you can change the startup disk or you can change the settings around your RAM. If you want to access BIOS settings, click F2 button immediately after powering up your computer. But I won't recommend you to change any settings on BIOS unless you are an expert or guided by an expert. Because if you change anything in your BIOS settings without knowing, you may mess up with your computer. That's all folks, I hope now you know what is a BIOS. I hope you enjoyed watching our video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to receive the notifications of our future videos. Talk to you guys in my next video. Thanks.